o primeiro. So basically, we are, we are originally an Indian brand. My family comes from uh, Assam. My grandfather started the business uh, in 1951, so we're going to be celebrating our 70 years in 2021. And in the perfumery industry, that's a big thing to be in the third generation. I am the third generation of the business. I'm the uh, consulting perfumer who is now coming to India more and more. Before this, we have been present in the Gulf. Some of you may know we have our presence in uh, mostly in the Gulf countries and about 45 other countries around the world. And um, early last year, we decided that we needed to come to India because we believe now the consumer is ready and the millennial population is ready to be exploring the lifestyle that their counterparts around the world enjoy. And they wanted to enjoy the same thing. And today we're very happy to partner with Health and Glow. Thank you guys Thank you so for much. giving us the opportunity. And I believe that we will be able to make a mark for the Indian population. So we will be launching more and more products which are uh, destined for the Indian population because the taste of the Indian people is considerably different from what it is in the West. So it's not about having a one size fits all. Yeah, so something special for uh, our people, our region, something that will suit the weather, the skin type and everything else that goes with it. And uh, I would like to thank uh, Shanvi for giving us the opportunity and gracing our occasion today and doing a launch. So, so I'm really happy that it's Ajmal because uh, you know it's, it's originated here and now it's ready to take over the market in India. And I'm the person to start it here, also, uh, you know, with the association with Health and Glow. I'm really, really happy about it. Also, I think Ajmal um, really takes care of the customers, uh, Thank you. you say, your yeah, taste, I can say. And they have around 300, uh, um, uh, yeah, uh, 300 kinds reference. of oh, references. References. Yeah. References. references, different types of fragrances. Different types of fragrances. So that's huge. And uh, I, I'm all set to explore. Uh, because I'm a fragrance lover, I have like, I don't know how many kinds of fragrances I have already experimented and tried and loved and this is going to be new for me as me as well. I have been through their manufacturing process and I have, you know, I have um, done my own research, little research which I always do before, you know, uh, associating with any brand and I am really, really impressed. I'm sure uh, customers here in Bangalore, um, they are ready to experiment this and uh, accept them, welcome them whole wholeheartedly and So how much a perfume is important to every individual according to you? For me, see trust me, I am I love fragrances, I die for it. So the first thing wherever I go, the first thing I pick is fragrance and also it, it in instantly boosts your you know confidence, your mood, your uh, entire personality. So I think that's really, really important and uh, everybody should use fragrance. <laughs> Thank you. Thank that's you so much. That's a good pitch.